Alright. Welcome back to some more Super Auto Pets. Play against own pack. Okay, confirm. What was I what was I what was I doing? Uh okay, let's go for the full pack. I haven't played this in a little while, I don't think. Uh we're not gonna play against our own pack, we're gonna play against all packs since it's a little bit more fair in that uh regard. Obviously early game is easier. Uh, obviously uh the the uh getting like ten wins on the normal against all packs is pretty difficult considering like normal pack doesn't have the same kind of scaling that the pay to play pack does, but uh yeah. Thanks for thanks for being patient. I'm uh, I'm here now. I was actually out doing a delivery, which is why I was uh, a little bit late today. So I appreciate you waiting. Uh, let's go ahead and freeze this. Uh, for the YouTube audience, um, if you enjoy the video, make sure to uh, smack it with a with a nice like and uh, subscribe if you want to see more. Share it around if you want to. And I'm streaming uh, every day on Twitch. From uh, 12 to whatever time I stop, I usually start a little bit early just so I can record a little bit of Super Auto Pets before uh, before the before the afternoon hits. But uh, for now, we're gonna be the stormy. Uh... Yes, yeah, so it'll be wet. Oh God, we'll be a wet muffin. God, that sounds awful. All right, we win these easily every day of the week. We win these because you're only gonna get one HP, baby. Well, to be fair, I would have lost if the if the uh, ant buff hadn't gone on the correct unit, so, realistically, I mean, there's no way to know what would have- Okay, well, I mean, if you insist, video game. If. You. Insist. What are we looking at here? Right now, we're looking at a pretty standard build. Nothing- nothing extremely special that, uh... God, that scarab in the back is gonna- God. Saying scarab out loud makes you think of Kepri. Also... We're gonna win this, but only just barely, because my ant buff kept going to like the unit slightly behind, which didn't help because ants have one HP. Hello. Uh. Tell you what. Hello. Goodbye. Hello. Please hit the pufferfish. Thank, thank Christ. Oh my God, that would have been, that would have been unfortunate had I not gotten what I wanted there. Hello, my beautiful girl. How are you? You're wondering what I'm talking to or who I'm talking to. It's my beautiful Belladonna girl, my little wolf girl, my little hetero heterochromic eye girl. I have the door to my room open because no one's, uh, no one's actually home right now. And I don't want the dogs to feel like they're, uh, to feel lonely, so. I think we lose this. Wow. We lose it because our pufferfish didn't get a good, uh, didn't get any good hits. And this guy had the most, like, in, had, like, 50 summons on his squad, like, two minutes into the game. It's actual insanity. There's nothing that I want here, I don't think. You know what? Actually. Swan will stick around long term, so we'll give Swan meat, we'll put the Swan up front to take out whatever strong unit the other person sends out, and then our Blowfish can go through their weaker units, if the second unit happens to be a weaker unit. Which it is a weaker unit, this guy has a horse with 16 abilities to summon right now. So, hopefully, nice, 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 that's actually fantastic. I wish my Blowfish would hit their horse. In all honesty, I wish my blowfish would have hit their horse. I lose because this guy has 50 summons. Is it the same guy? Must be. Yeah, I barely lose. My blowfish didn't didn't come through for me there. I needed it to come through for me in that situation. It's unfortunate, but that's life. Mosquito? Uh, it's not the worst idea in the world. Now a turtle. A turtle is something to look at. Garlic. All right. Actually, we might end up freezing most of the shop. Yeah, actually, we're gonna freeze most of the shop. I know exactly what we're gonna do here. I think I know exactly what we're gonna do here. We'll take out their front unit very easily, and then my swan will take out their secondary unit with the meat. Unfortunate. That did a lot of damage. And I draw. I By draw, I mean I lose because this back unit had garlic. Jesus, man. 
Alright, whatever. We have our own garlic now. We have our own garlic now. Get rid of you. Buy you. Put you in between these two, which means I want you there with you there. Obviously, level you up. These two synergize well together. Only issue is, I don't think that's where we're going with this. Sorry about that. My dokies needed some chucking in on. Alright, what do we do here? I think... I think we keep these two things frozen, right? For sure. We keep those two things frozen. Right now, I think I sell the... You know what? Mm. Okay. So this is what we're going to do. Goodbye. You, were, you had a great run. Hello. You were going to have a great run. Uh, I think I'm good with this squad. <laughs> We're going to have an awful time here. Yeah, we are going to have an awful time here. Jesus Christ. Oh, thank you. Because of that, we tie. Because of that, we won. We would have tied otherwise. Great. Nice of you to show up, Mr. Fish. Half a year late, but nice of you to show up. I think I like the squad the way it looks right now. We're going to need something going in the future for us, so... Hmm. I love the swan. I do. Believe me when I tell you the swan is my child. <laughs> you, like, you always come too late, man. You always A second one always shows up way too late. Alright, we're going to get a bunch of garbage here. This is something I want. We're just going to roll through the whole entire thing, aren't we? Right now my best unit is a blowfish. That really, really sucks. I really don't know what we're going to do late, uh, late, uh, or uh, later in this game. Yeah, we straight up lose. What is that? Is that our last loss? I gotta tell you, man, we went against some. We gonna we went against a lot of early game horse squads that ended up working out. They shouldn't have worked out as well as they did, but they did, and I have nothing to say except good for those people. Honestly, that's where you're rolling this. The s the bear the suspicious mouths. We tell no lies here, all truths, except when we don't, which rarely happens, but yeah. What are you gonna do? Can't always win them all, can't, uh, can't get them all. We are going to win this, barely, but we are. <laughs> okay, alright, this is what we're gonna do here, right? Roll me one time. Uh, nothing I want to see here, so hello. And end our turn. Putting that B there makes it essentially a 3-2. This is a bit unfortunate. Luckily, we run through those two units easily, but it doesn't matter because their beaver is just going to take us out. Damn. That was a close one. You know we have to run a headshot, right? Like, there's, like, I never really had a choice. I never really had a choice. So that would put... You know, with the small scaling I'm getting, it actually works out really well. Thankfully, that horse ended up not doing anything for that guy right there. 
unfortunately we don't get through their first two units but we do end up winning this just barely though and by winning i mean drawing but a draw is a win when you're going against a level two horse that literally is summoning 50 million units in a row okay tell you what tell you what hello goodbye Hello. Goodbye. Goodbye. Hello. Hi. And last but not least, I think we sell our swan and just have and try to get the dog rolling. I like the swan though. No, I like the swan enough to not do that. Yeah, I actually like the swan a lot. But we'll uh, we'll see about doing a little play here. In a second. Alright. Uh, what can we show next turn to facilitate this? I think we sell the swan next turn. Th those rolls were fine. For four gold, we're gonna get a uh, one one on our dog, which is fine. I think we lose this right here. Yeah, we definitely lose this one, but just barely, you know. We just barely lose it. Swan was cute. Very enjoyable unit. Hello? Combine? Flamingo would be very nice too. Hello? Hello? Goodbye? Hello? And... Yeah, I think this works actually. Uh, can I get a caterpillar rolling? Probably. Do I want to? Not really. Like, realistically, what's this game all about? Is it about winning? I mean, if I wanted to win, I would just, like, try my best to, like, get lucky and get the best shops possible. But obviously, that's not going to really happen all the time, as much as we'd wanted to. We're going to lose this, because this guy has an incredible dog. Not just an incredible dog, but he has incredible, like, units in front of it. Oh well. Happens to the best of us, you know? Um... <laughs> Hello? Uh, we'll freeze you. For the time being, we'll freeze you. Garlic on our dog. We'll run a cricket. Uh, a little bit too late for a puppy. Uh, this guy would be pretty cute, but I really don't see anything I could do with that. This is actually really good. Can we? Okay. Next turn's gonna be a. Next turn's gonna be a great turn. I just need to survive, which is the big one of the biggest issues here. I'm just not getting a good opportunity to survive in these in these situations. I'm kind of just getting like obliterated straight up, like every two seconds. Luckily, my hedgehog does take this boy out. And I do end up taking out his sheep so he doesn't get to do any damage to my boy. And because of... We win, actually. We win this because we... No, we don't? No, we don't. We don't win this. We draw it. No, we don't. We have enough health on our back unit. Jesus, dude. Imagine being able to do quick maths. Not me. Could never be me. Alright. This is gonna be a, this is gonna be a fun turn. Goodbye. Hello? Hello? Goodbye? Hello? Hello? Alright, uh, are we doing- how are we doing this? Okay, so 4, 4, right, 2, 2, 1. Okay, so we want this guy to get buffed. We don't want the hedgehog to get buffed. The hedgehog is cute, but it's about to- it's the next thing on the chopping block here for sure. Actually, it's the next thing on the chopping block here for sure, but not this turn. Not this turn. Definitely want a can. You know, actually, this is a good this is a good synergy. Actually, we can we can facilitate this by selling this and combining these two. Yeah, I think this is good if we survive. Obviously, we have to survive, which I don't know if that's gonna happen, but we'll we'll see. Unfortunately, the bus is gonna end up taking out my front two units. I should have switched. No, I couldn't switch positions. It wouldn't have mattered.
We're gonna barely survive, we're gonna not survive, and we're gonna draw. You know I should buy a hat. I haven't bought a hat. I haven't like gone into like the in-game currency shop at all. Or in-game shop at all, rather. Goodbye. Hello? I can do this, and then I can sell it, right? Which will give someone a buff, and then I can just buy a secondary one. Two, two, four, four. Poodle not getting buffs is not fine for me. I think I want the Poodle to get the buffs. Because Poodle's been my, long, my scaler for a very long time. Ooh, this is going to be very bad. Ooh, he's going to run through three of my units. I'll still end up winning this, barely, but I will end up winning it. And the only reason I won that is because I had garlic. Without garlic, I lose that. <laughs> it'd be, you know, it'd be fun if I if I had gotten the puppy like 10 years sooner. Obviously, I didn't, so. It's fine. You know, there's something to be said about getting an early leopard. So much so. That I think that might be... A play that we can do, not D play, but A play. So I definitely don't want to buy and sell anything, or buy and sell anything like rapidly right now. Uh, do I want garlic this turn? No, I don't. Want I don't think I need garlic this turn. Buy. So. Buy. Roll. Freeze. 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 And turn. Wow, we just barely get through his front unit. That ox is gonna like is gonna have a a field day with my boys. I'm actually just barely gonna die to it here, and we're gonna barely win. Jeez. These squads are getting tough, man. Yeah, obviously I can't fit a worm. It's too late for a worm. As adorable as it may be. Nah, it's 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 a cute thought. It's a cute thought, but no. That's not where we're going with this build. Right now, we're going this way with the build. Garlic, roll me, freeze, freeze, and turn. Mm. I don't know why I I froze that uh. Why I froze that out? I mean, I guess I'll hold on to it until I want to like switch out, switch out units eventually, which will eventually happen. But obviously, it's not right now. It's not a right now situation. All right, we're starting to actually run into some like easier like squads, but I guess that might be because we're scaling. I'm actually not sure like how hard the originally early squads were. All right, we're obviously gonna get a can, right? Cans, cans are cool. Uh, as for everything else, I think I. Th think that we're gonna run a leopard right I think that's the way we go with this so you gotta ask yourself what do you do instead of keeping that beetle you buy then you sell this right and then you buy a flamingo really is that where we're gonna go a 910 is I can roll one time you know what keep the rhino roll one time Keep that, and I don't know, just put a scorpion in the second slot, I guess. <laughs> There's really no reason not to. Melon. Melon, melon, melon. We're gonna want to swap up. Oh, okay, well, it's a good thing that I put... Oh, well, the scorpion would have been great in the first slot. Live and learn, I guess, right? You still win. You still win these, but live and learn. I mean, how am I supposed to know this guy? Who this, who this guy's gonna hit? You can't. You know, this might be the squad, actually. This might be our squad. I think... I think this is our squad. So now we just... Squad up. In case we have to switch, we're gonna, we're gonna wanna buy some, We're gonna wanna buy cans whenever we see them. In case we wanna switch anytime in the near future, obviously. Right now, this is our squad. For the time being. 
the the ox in the front gets replaced. It's our first unit to get replaced here. This is good, actually. That's actually really good. He's gonna summon two chicks with the same attack, which is gonna suck. But I think we still win this, regardless. Yeah, we still win it barely, but we do win it because that scorpion was actually phenomenal and took out that took out that really high health uh, rooster without any trouble. Something to be said about a cow. There's something to be said about a cow. No, I have nothing to say about it right now, but there is something. There is something to it. Malone? Okay. This is making me think that next turn we're definitely gonna like we're definitely gonna sell off the either scorpion or the buffalo. Probably the buffalo. I have a feeling it's gonna be the buffalo, and then that way we can start getting some better units on the on the board. The cheetah's cool. Like the cheetah's cool enough to keep around because if it does get a great snipe, ooh, so close to getting a great snipe. It could be really, really good for all of us, for everyone involved. And this is fine. We're gonna run straight through most of his front his front squad. Only thing that's gonna suck is the fact that he summons three chicks, so we lose no matter what here, but. I mean, it was. I mean, we did. We did our best, right? We did what we could in that situation. I can't. Uh, I can't get mad. He had a. He had a. What's it called? A bird that copied uh, the ability of the what's his face. Um, what's that unit I'm thinking of? Uh, the one that a uh, tiger. His his uh peak, his parrot in the back copied a tiger. I mean, all right. Well, we did our best. <laughs> what can we do? I probably played that poorly, but I really don't think we uh, we had the same kind of like uh, uh, the good enough synergies to actually like take that to the end. But we had fun, and hopefully we win the next one. <laughs>